Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm going to show you how to make a page template for your WordPress website. Okay, so I'm at my website wordpress-websitebuilder.com and um, if you want to come and visit it just click on the link in the description or maybe you're watching this video on my website. Alright, so what I want to do is make a template that makes a page without a sidebar. Okay, I don't want a sidebar. Okay, so without having to explain too much, I am just going to hand some code over to you and you're going to make a template yourself. So the first thing that you need to do is make the template. Now what I did is go and open up Notepad but I am going to get my notepad that I made oops it's on the other screen I'll be back in a minute I'll just go and grab it right here it is here I've already made it I'm going to open it up now <coughs> the main thing is that this part here actually makes the template and I'm naming it No Sidebar. That's the name of the template. Now, um, the this here, this line of um, code here gets the header, obviously, get header. Um, this one here starts the content, okay? Now, I mean, you don't have to do this. This part here I actually put in myself um, as an extra. Um, sometimes I don't have that there, I just have div id equals content um, because I had to um, make the text indent a bit. Okay, I'm taking the text in 35 pixels because it was sticking out too far. Right, anyway so it says if it's got a post put it there blah 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 right go down and it says um, down the bottom it says end of the div and then it says get the footer okay that means put the footer in there after all this information now um, make sure you name your template something different like no sidebar or new template for me or something like that do not make it page.php or single post.php or anything that might be in there already. Right, so what I did is I created this. Now this should be okay for you too to create something like this. There's no harm in testing it anyway. Right, so what we're going to do is go and save it. So we go save as and I'm just going to call it no sidebar and then I'm going to put dot PHP okay now it's not a, going to be a text file it's going to be a dot PHP file I'm going to save it so you, and also you got to remember where you save it because you want to upload it to the server so save it right so now I'm going to get rid of this and I'm going to go to my server which is hostgator.com and I'm going to sign in to my control panel which I've already done and then I'm going to go to file manager here under files okay double click on it and then I want to go to the document root for my website which is wordpresswebsitebuilder.com okay and we're going in and then we have to navigate to where um, the themes are. So we've got to go into WordPress content, wp-content, themes, and then I've got to know what theme I'm using, okay? So I'm using the White House theme and I'm going to go in there. Now you can find that out in your themes section under appearance in the back of your dashboard. Right, so what I want to do now is upload that file right here okay I'm in the themes directory now I'm going to go upload and I want to find that new um, file that I made it's under PHP 
and it's called no sidebar right I'm going to open it and it will download it I mean upload it sorry bit of a confusion there and when it says a hundred percent complete you can press this and it'll say do you want to close this window yes right now when you get here that means that your um, new file should be in here so here it is here no sidebar.php right so when I go back to my website now I should have a choice that I can use this so I'm going back into my website now I'm just going to show you this this is the about me page with the sidebar now I'm going into the dashboard and here's the about me page that I can edit now I just need to press on update just so it can find my page okay so now there's a choice here okay for the templates now if I didn't put that extra template in there I wouldn't have a choice so this this template section wouldn't exist alright it only exists if you've got templates right so I'm going to press the no sidebar template and press update and it's updating okay it's working and now I'm going to go to the website and update the about page okay now here it is and it's got no sidebar and it's also got this little thing here that's not meant to be there so I'm gonna have to go and fix that that's not right that's not meant to be there um, here's the footer here right so I'm gonna go and remove the footer and remove that so I'm going back to my host gator control panel and I'm going back into file manager to edit that file again but I actually have it open down here so I'm just gonna go here and I'm gonna right click on it and press edit now if I have a look when it comes up there should be an extra little um, sign in there that's in the wrong spot it's taking a while Radio. so what have we got here here we go look it's sitting right there that extra one by itself get rid of it so we'll just backspace and take that away so that should be right now I'm going to go down the bottom and get rid of the footer because I don't want that on there either and also um, see how it said get footer and this one says get header um, well I can take the header away as well if I want to and just have the content um, but I'll take this footer away first also um, if you do want to put the sidebar in there you basically get um, write the PHT that says get sidebar it's quite simple right so let's save the changes now according uh, apparently <laughs> it doesn't always work but if I go back there now this footer when I refresh it this footer and this mark should be gone so let's press on about okay there we go we're missing that ugly little mark there and also the foot is gone which is great okay so there we go there's my page now all the other pages because I've they're on the default template they have the sidebar still now if I don't want the sidebar all I have to do is go and edit that page and choose the other template alright um, I hope I didn't confuse you too much and thanks for watching hi guys it's me again don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and also don't forget to visit my website at wordpress-websitebuilder.com I'll see you there